A safe home is a radioactive home. In fact, you probably have some radioactive material on your ceiling somewhere, and it's keeping you safe. If you didn't know, what makes many smoke detectors work is americium-241, a highly radioactive synthetic chemical element. And the way these smoke detectors work is the same reason they're so safe. Americium-241 is an alpha emitter. See, there are three primary kinds of nuclear radiation. There's alpha rays, beta rays, and gamma rays. And the ways they interact with the world differ dramatically, and that shapes how dangerous they are. An alpha ray, or perhaps more accurately an alpha particle, is a whole-ass helium nucleus, two protons and two neutrons stuck together. When an element, like americium-241, is heavy enough, it decays by breaking off a nuclear chunk and sending it on its way. Now, the reason alpha decay happens at all is because in any nucleus there are two opposing forces. The strong nuclear force, which tries to hold the nucleus together, and the electromagnetic force, which tries to push the like-charged protons apart. The strong nuclear force is famously very short-range, and when the atom gets big enough, the electromagnetic repulsion of the protons overcome the attraction of the strong nuclear force. When that happens, the nucleus ejects something. And that something happens to be a helium nucleus. Why? Well, basically because the helium nucleus is the most stable of all nuclei, making it energetically favorable to form and eject a helium nucleus rather than a single proton. In fact, in some cases, it costs the nucleus energy to expel a proton, whereas it would gain energy by expelling a helium nucleus. Now, as I said, americium-241 is an alpha emitter, meaning it ejects those helium nuclei. And those nuclei are very heavy, at least compared to other kinds of radiation. And that means that even though they might carry a lot of energy, they still move fairly slowly, meaning that they have more time to leach their energy to their environment before they travel too far. The upshot is that a thin plastic housing can block the alpha particles from escaping, but the air inside the housing has its electrons knocked out by those same alpha particles. This creates a small trickle of current between two air-gapped electrodes. And when smoke enters the chamber, it blocks some of the current because the sooty smoke allows the ions to coalesce, preventing a clean current flow. The electronics then detect that reduction in current, triggering an alarm that there's smoke in your home and hopefully keeping you safe. But don't let this innocuous description of alpha particles fool you. Americium-241 is highly toxic exactly because it emits heavy low penetration radiation. If you ingest it, it'll stick around in your body for years, constantly irradiating your insides, typically causing cancer in low doses or acute radiation poisoning in high doses. So don't fiddle with your detector. Leave it to the experts to handle, lest you risk your health.